Iris is actually shorter than the player. Here's what she looks like on Winrow Island. Here's what she looks like on Cirrus Island. You can change the colour of the boxing gloves you wear when you have the boxing fighting style. Clothiers all sell gloves that you can buy for 4 galleons in any colour that you want. Equip the gloves in your vanity slot and the boxing gloves will change to match the colour. If your hunger bar is ever low, you can come to the mines where you will find the finest slop that you cannot eat. Even though the prompt appears, you cannot interact with it and eat it. Who would want to eat that low poly slop anyways? You can temporarily not wear the Ravenna disguise. First, sail towards Ravenna while you are not wearing a disguise. Make sure you are actually controlling the boat and your character is holding the wheel. As you approach Ravenna, you will get the notification saying you have been disguised, but since your character is holding the ship wheel, the disguise isn't applied. Before coming off the ship, wait a little bit as the game will try to disguise you again. Now you can come off the ship and walk around Ravenna without a disguise, but only for a little bit. While you are undisguised, all the Ravenna guards will target you. As the game is constantly trying to disguise you, this is only temporary, and after a little bit, the disguise will automatically reappear on you. The player holds the Triaster of Bronze in their left hand, while Calvis actually holds his Triaster of Bronze in his right hand. Are you struggling to navigate through Mount Orthis at night? Just take out an anglerfish. The anglerfish gives the strongest concentrated source of light in the game. The torch lights up a bigger area, but not as bright as the anglerfish's light. Whenever you M1 with a fighting style that isn't Cannon Fist, you will move forward a little bit. When you M1 in Tallgrass, you still move forward. When you M1 while not in Tallgrass, you still move forward. But when you M1 at the edge of the Tallgrass, you will not move forward at all.
playtime for a save is tracked from the moment you begin to create your account. The time spent on this character creation screen will count towards my time played. I will AFK on the screen for a few hours so you can see. Seven hours later. As you can see, I'm only level 1 and I have 7 plus hours of playtime on this save already. This is completely useless as you can't trade high level items to low level saves anymore. At Munera Garden, you can complete this NPC's quest, which will remove all of the trees from the arena. This is what the arena looks like when you haven't completed the quest. This is what the arena looks like when you have completed the quest. People who haven't completed the quest can still climb and jump on the tree, but to those who have completed the quest, since the trees aren't there for them, it will look like the other person is just floating. Since people who have completed the quest can't see or touch the trees, people who haven't done the quest can actually see the people who have done the quest just go inside the trees. At Palo Town and Cirrus Island, there are quests to repair a broken ship. If you have completed the quest, then the ship will be repaired, and you obviously can't repair it with a hammer. If you haven't completed the quest, then the ship will be broken, and until you complete the quest, you can indefinitely repair it. Here I haven't done the broken skyship quest, and I don't even have it meaning I can just repair this ship and waste all my galleons. I can even waste my galleons twice as fast by using the bronze repair hammer. <laughs> 